graduates, please proceed to your seats so we can celebrate your accomplishments.
Good afternoon. For those who don't know me, I'm, I'm Michael Hildreth. I'm a professor of physics, and I'm the interim dean of the College of Science. And on behalf of the deans, faculty, and registrar of the University of Notre Dame, I welcome you to this joyous celebration of your achievements in anticipation of the conferral of degrees by Father Jenkins tomorrow morning. This is the first ever, and maybe the last ever, College of Science commencement ceremony, so you have that honor. I hope you'll enjoy it. So it's now my honor to introduce the other members of the platform party. I invite each member to stand as I read your name. Associate Dean for Collegiate Sequence Majors, International Studies and Diversity, Sister Kathleen Cannon. Associate Dean and Director of the Center for Health Sciences Advising, Father Jim Foster. <laughs> Director of Undergraduate Studies in Neuroscience and Behavior, Nancy Michael. <laughs> Professor Jim Paris. Chair of the Department in Applied Computational Mathematics and Statistics, Bei Hu. Chair of the Department of Biological Sciences, Jason Rohr. Chair of the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry, Brian Baker. Chair of the Department of Physics, Peter Garnovich. Chair of the Department of Mathematics, Richard Hind. Interim Associate Dean of Research and Graduate Studies, Marianne McDowell. Associate Dean for Interdisciplinary Studies and Faculty Development, Steve Corselli. Associate Dean for Undergraduate Studies, Dan Gazelter. Lauren Sullivan, one of your classmates, who will give our invocation. Please welcome all members of the platform party. So before the invocation, I have some announcements. First, you may follow the sequence of this ceremony by turning to page 55 in your commencement weekend program or accessing the College of Science website, science.nd.edu, from your phone. Second, this ceremony is being live streamed and recorded. So information may be found on the commencement website at commencement.nd.edu. And I would welcome and greet all of you who are watching from elsewhere. Uh, sorry you couldn't join us on this beautiful day, but I hope you enjoy the ceremony. So with that, I will now call on Lauren Sullivan to give the invocation. Please rise. Let us pray. God of hope and joy, we, the class of 2021, gather today with sincere gratitude to you for this long-awaited day of celebration and the culmination of four years of accomplishments. Your loving presence has offered us the courage to persevere and to embrace the many gifts with which you have blessed us throughout our time as students. Thank you for our parents and family members who sacrificed so that we have the privilege to sit here today as new alumni of the University of Notre Dame, who served as our steadfast cheerleaders while we navigated the successes and failures of college. Thank you for the rectors and hall staff who took us under, the, our wing, under their wings when we arrived on welcome weekend, to random roommates and icebreakers who showed us for the first time what it meant to call Notre Dame home. Thank you for the incredible professors and faculty who challenged us to answer and to ask profound questions of our own, who cultivated our minds and hearts alongside one another so that we might apply their lessons not only in the classroom but for making concrete change in the world around us. Thank you for our peers, our classmates, our certain to be lifelong friends. Together, we have thrived during late nights in Hesburgh, football games, service projects, adventures abroad, and more, which have shaped us into the confident, diverse, and wholeheartedly compassionate class we are. As we begin the next stage of our lives, may you continue to bless us and to make your peaceful presence known. Guide us to be lifelong students who are boundlessly curious, who seek the truth, and who dedicate ourselves to serving others. Help us to remember we may always draw on your wisdom and strength when challenges emerge in our post-graduation lives. As uncertain as the future may be, we are grateful to have a home under the dome to return to, which is made possible by you, Lord, and those sitting around us. Today, we rejoice in you, loving Father, 
as we seek to honor your spirit here and always. Amen. I now call on Associate Dean for Undergraduate Studies, Dan Gazelter, to present the baccalaureate candidates. You're already rising, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Will the candidates who have completed the requirements for the baccalaureate degree please rise? Dean Hildreth, these students, have successfully fulfilled the requirements of the College of Science. With the approval of the faculty, they are now presented to you to receive evidence of the baccalaureate degree. Tomorrow, President Jenkins, by exercising the authority of the trustees of the University of Notre Dame, legally vested by the people of the state of Indiana, and upon the recommendation of the faculty, will confer upon each of you who have fulfilled the stated requirements the appropriate baccalaureate degree with all the rights, privileges, duties, and responsibilities of that degree. Please be seated. While the first group of graduates is coming forward, let me give you an overview of how you move through the ceremony. When you reach the top of the ramp, please hand your name card to Professor Whaley, who will instruct you when to move across the stage. You begin moving before your name is read, so just don't get confused about that. You'll receive a diploma folder and then walk to center stage where you'll be greeted by me. We'll do a little elbow bump and you'll have a photo taken. So don't dawdle, but we'll keep, keep the thing moving here. Then please continue to the east side of the stage and then go back down the south ramp. It's very confusing, but we have traffic cops up here to direct you. So at the front of section D, which is over there, there's a photo where you can have an official photo taken once you come down off the stage and the photography company Grad Images will contact you via email after the ceremony so that you can have access to the photographs. Next, I'd like to introduce Professor Bei Hu, Chair of the Department of Applied and Computational Mathematics and Statistics, who will announce his department's degree recipients. Professor Hu. Thank you, Dean Hildreth. The degree recipients from the Department of Applied and Computational Mathematics and Statistics are Santiago Rafael Alvarado. Alejandro Botaro. Brian Lawrence Conlon. Caroline N. Darwin. Marae Shingley Dillon. Emma Grace Doyle. Leah Therese Grabowski. Sarah Therese Herbers. Abby James Herman. Greta Klaus. Justin Kenneth Knowles. Alison Mary Lahanka. Daniel Robert Lipa. Catherine Kentington McCann. Megan Catherine Matursky. Daniel Francis Moran. Georgia Charlotte Mudd. Kelsey Lynn Muha, Ren Jie Pan, Peng Shen, K. 
Caitlin Grace Salas. Abigail Catherine Stokes. Emma Sophia Strauss. Daniel Sun. David William Toes. Jesslyn Brenda Trendad. Jenna Elizabeth Wade. Josie Lynn Wessler. Christina Lauren White. Sun Yi. Wei Han Zhu. Thomas Daniel Majin. Mary Claire Morley. Joan J. Sun. Next, Professor Jason Rohr, Chair of the Department of Biological Sciences, will announce his department's degree recipients. Thank you, Professor Hugh. The degree recipients from the Department of Biological Sciences, Biological Sciences major are William Walker Aberger, Lauren Elizabeth Albee, Gretchen Margareta Lorraine Andreasen, James Patrick Applewhite, Joseph Christian Baca, Kristen Elizabeth Baird, Elsa Marie Barron, Alexander John Beacom, Amy Marie Bowling, Jordan Lee Brown, Landis W. Collins, Aiden Michael Cook, Matthew Richard Donahue, Mary Kathleen Eberwine, Matthew James Gaboric, Luke Anthony Gianetta, Patrick Terrence Gorman, Emily Kathleen Hansen, Elizabeth Ann Heidenreich, Callan Caroline Herman, John Francis Hulaven, Natsumi Holmes, Jessica Edoji Igidi, Nicholas Andrew Iovino, Owen Bailey Ivan, Lauren Michelle Klein, Patrick Warren Coleman. Caroline Healy Langley. Andrea Sophia Lebron Figueroa. Devine Lee. Joseph Sunwoo Lee. Jenna Nicole Lane. Isaac E. Lacona. Matthew Paul LaCurcy, Connor Mc Anthony McConville, Woo! 
Chloe Alexis Morton. Michelle Murray Mufawad. Abigail May Orsinelli. Hannah Marisa Gail Oshiro. Sophia Maria Patano. Christian Alexander Paulick. Rachel Ray Rocco. Connor Angelo Roccagelli. Julie Nicole Rasta. Victoria Hope Roosh. Kathleen Kelly Ryan. Nicole Catherine Scora. Maeve R. Swinehart. Alexis Marie Walchmidt. Jenna Eileen Whalen. Jimmy Saurur. Sarah Bernice Zabala. Morgan Elena Zeff. Grace Y. Zhang. Julia Francis Zimlick. Now, Professor Mary Ann McDowell, Associate Dean, will announce the environmental sciences majors. Thank you, Professor Rohr. The degree recipients from the Department of Biological Sciences, environmental sciences major are Matthew Alexander Auberg, <laughs> Sydney Kialoha Paoli Fumiko Brady, Brianna Therese Brown. Corbin Gail Carlson. Catherine Lee Kanis. Ashley Payant Finster. Catherine Elizabeth Franz. Jacob Anthony Fries. Matthew Joseph Gerber, Daniel Stanley Griffin, Katerina Maria Jamsek, Sydney Irene Loudon, Gabriella Margarita Marines Gio, Matthew Edward Mulatto. Michael Robert Piotrowski. Trent Walker Robinette. Kyle Patrick Walker. Karina Jessica Walton Roberts. Abigail Ann White. Kayla Renee Wood. Next, Professor Brian Baker, Chair of the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry, will announce his department's degree recipients. Thank you, Professor McDowell. The degree recipients from the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry are Savannah Grace Inez, <laughs> Jeffrey M. Betog, <laughs> Leah May. Bodhi. Sarah Marie Monica Brainard. Jada Mayafu Burton. Emma Mary Cahill. Laura Christine Carroll. 
Hunter Chang. Rhea D'Souza. Bryce Paul George Jabara. Gail Francesca Fernandez. Meredith Rosa Flanagan. Matthew John Guggenbiller. Claire Francis Hartman. Jennifer Jia Yi Huang. Thomas Michael Cassius. Ryan David Clevens. Alyssa Ann Labella. Joseph Thomas Lazara. Yeah! Morgan Olivia McCabe. Joseph Patrick Mullen. Brandon Joseph Navarro. Yared Alem Nugus. Patrick Michael O'Connor. Olivia F. Perez. Sophia M. Perez. Melissa Timea Perko. Catherine Elizabeth Perk. Eleanor Grace Schnauts. Noah Ashton Springer. Alexis Grace Stensby. Zoe Augustus Tulauskas. Trenton John Winters. Clarissa Ann Yunkel. Andrew Malcolm Zoss. Paige Min Howard. Olivia Winifred Love Lanchoni. Suryoung Lee. David Charles Morris. Sarah Ronnie Minakshi Pulley Reddy. Kimberly Therese Reardon. Andrew Laban Smith. Elias Burnett Travis. Renita Wilson. Abigail Benedict Wood. Alexander Robert Himes. Next, Professor Richard Hind, Chair of the Department of Mathematics, will announce his department's degree recipients. Thank you, Professor Baker. The degree recipients from the Department of Mathematics are Abigail Ashley Anderson, Rachel Marie Black, Spencer James Brown, Lauren Ann Caffarelli, William Russell Clark, Edward Anthony Devane, Christina Marie Dito, Benjamin J. Ferris, Ashley Ishan Fu, Bo Patrick Heatherman, Abigail Lorraine Heck, Catherine Ruth Hyrie. Alex March Cockot, Christina Maria Kula, Andrew Joseph Lifka, Wee Shin Lee Lin, Bo Ni. Colleen Marie O'Leary, 
Juliana Rear Pelicano. Cassandra Perez. Aram John Rashduni. Jill Teresa Ruin. Chloe Bell Spang. Ethan Mitchell Sunshine. Stephanie Nicole Wallace. Zifan Zhang. Chang Zhao. Francis Norman Zorno. Next, Professor Peter Garnovich, Chair of the Department of Physics, will introduce his department's degree recipients. Thank you, Professor Hind. The degree recipients from the Department of Physics are Hayden Matthew Adams, <laughs> Colin Thomas Beveridge, <laughs> Kevin Austin Borsiak, <laughs> Nicholas James Caterisano, Maeve Kathleen Curlis. Joshua Howard Follinsby. Alec Joseph Gonzalez. Dylan Lee Hassenauer. Tessa M. Klein. John Brick Mayer. Charles William Martyr. Max Nam Duong Nguyen. Daniel John Palmer. Patrick Rodman Sanson. Joshua Roger, Roger Say. Robert John Schiller. Lauren Elizabeth Ward. Sierra Lisa Y. Miller. Alexander Gerard Witte. Li Hao Yan. Diego Garcia. Taylor Ray Johnson. Paul David Kinkoff. Ryan A. Neff. Christian Thomas Oakley. Daniel Spelinski. Now we've reached the seventh inning stretch. Uh, so now my faculty colleagues will announce the College of Science student award winners from each department or major. So please stand as your name is called, and we ask for everyone to hold their raucous applause until all of the award winners from each program have been announced. From the Department of ACMS, we have two recipients of the Outstanding Applied and Computational Mathematics and Statistics Major Award. And they are Caroline Darwin from Middletown, New Jersey, and David Toast from Laporte, Indiana. Congratulations to you both. From the Department of Biological Sciences, the winner of the Paul F. Ware MD Excellence in Undergraduate Research Award is Alexis Walschmidt from Naperville, Illinois. 
The winner of the Robert Brocco MD Honors Research Award is Owen Ivan from Madison, Mississippi. We have two recipients of the Mr. and Mrs. Frank McDonald Undergraduate Research Award, and they are uh, Gretchen Andreasen from Madison, Indiana, and Sydney Loudon from Fort Worth, Texas. We have two recipients of the Outstanding Biological Scientist Award, and they are William A. Berger from Plano, Texas, and Aidan Cook from Fleming, New Jersey. The winner of the Outstanding Environmental Scientist Award is Abigail White from Rockwall, Texas. And finally, we have three recipients of the Outstanding Biology Student Leader Award, and they are Matthew Alberg from Beechwood, Ohio, Brianna Brown from Madison, New Jersey, and Grace Zhang from Morganville, New Jersey. Congratulations to all of you. From the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry, the winner of the Chemistry and Biochemistry Leadership Award is Matthew Guggenbiller from Columbus, Ohio. The winner of the Outstanding Biochemist Award is Bryce Zubara from Uniontown, Ohio. The winner of the Outstanding Biochemistry Research Award is Zoe Tolowskis from Birmingham, Alabama. The winner of the Outstanding Chemist Award is Renita Wilson from Olathe, Kansas. The winner of the Outstanding Chemistry Research Award is Andrew Smith from Rochester Hills, Michigan. The winner of the William R. Wishereth Outstanding Chemistry Major Award is Noah Springer from Zionsville, Indiana. The recipient of the Royal Society of Chemistry Certificate of Excellence is Jeffrey Betag from Freedom, Wisconsin. The ACS Division of Organic Chemistry Outstanding Senior Organic Chemistry Student is Abigail Wood from Michigan, Mishawaka, Indiana. The ACS Division of Physical Chemistry Outstanding Senior Physical Chemistry student is Sarah Renee Reddy from Cincinnati, Ohio. The ACS Division of Inorganic Chemistry Outstanding Senior Inorganic Chemistry student is Kimberly Riordan from New York, Delaware. The ACS Division of Analytical Chemistry Outstanding Senior Analytical Chemistry student is Emma Cahill from Naperville, Illinois. Congratulations to you all. From the Department of Mathematics, the Robert P. Bales Distinguished Mathematics Honors Scholar is Kyle Duffy from Newport Beach, California. The Robert P. Bales Distinguished Mathematics Scholar is Ethan Sunshine from Middletown, Delaware. We have three recipients of the Senior GE Prize for Honors Majors in Mathematics, and they are Alex Cockott from Granger, Indiana. Ting Gong from Zhejiang, China. And Wee Sin Lin from Guangzhou, China. Uh, there are five senior GE Prize for Mathematics majors, and they are Joshua Follinsby from West Newbury, Massachusetts. Yixian Fu from Beijing, China. Abigail Heck from Memphis, Tennessee. Ethan Sunshine from Middletown, Delaware. And Chang Zhao from Yuhan District, China. And finally, the Coletus Award in Mathematics goes to Alex Cockott from Granger, Indiana. Congratulations to you all. From the Neuroscience and Behavior major, the winner of the Outstanding Undergraduate Research Award is Ellen Gorman from Mountain Brook, Alabama. The winner of the Outstanding Undergraduate Teacher Teaching Award is Tanner Targelson from Saratoga Springs, New York. The winner of the Outstanding Undergraduate Leadership and Service Award is Monica Messaker from West Lafayette, Indiana. 
And the winner of the Universal Scholar Award is Alex Nisbet from Middleton, Wisconsin. Congratulations to each of you. From the Department of Physics, the winner of the Paul Shagnon Award is Sierra Weimiller from Franklin, New Jersey. The recipient of the Outstanding Physics Major is Charles Martyr from Mount Juliet, Tennessee. The recipient of the Outstanding Undergraduate Research Award is Robert Schiller from Malvern, New York. Congratulations to you all. the collegiate sequence majors of science computing and science business. We have two winners of these awards. They are Mariana Suarez of Coral, G Coral Gables, Florida, and John Ben Walter of Dallas, Texas. Congratulations to both of you. And from the science pre-professional studies major, the Dean Lawrence H. Baldinger Award has three winners, and they are Matthew L. Feldman of San Clemente, California, Daniel B. Shaw of Coropolis, Pennsylvania, and Eric M. Verhey of Reno, Nevada. The winner of the Patrick J. Nyland MD Award is Tyler M. Dan from Grand Rapids, Michigan, the winner of the Daniel and Ann Crossan Award is Samuel E. Gru from Shipshawana, Indiana. The Reverend Joseph L. Walter CSC Award has three winners, and they are Rachel L. Bar Bartnett of Fenton, Missouri, Jill M. Stakowski of Elma, New York, and Marissa R. Vandermissen of South Bend, Indiana. And the Samuel J. Schmel MD Award has three winners, and they are Michael A. Newcomb of St. Paul, Minnesota, Lauren E. Sullivan from St. Louis, Missouri, and Alex G. Thomas of Madison, Wisconsin. Congratulations to all of you. Let's have a final round of applause for all of those department award winners. Congratulations. Now we're going to do some college level awards. So I'd like to recognize those who have earned Latin honors. So we'll do this in sequence. For the students graduating cum laude, please stand. Will the students graduating magna cum laude please stand? With the Latin honor students who are graduating summa cum laude, this year that was a GPA of 3.982 or higher, please stand. Congratulations. Next, I wish to acknowledge and honor faculty and students who have won College of Science awards. When I announce your name, please walk to center stage. We have two distinguished faculty members who recently won significant awards from the College of Science. The Father James L. Schiltz CSC Doris and Jean Leonard Teaching Award is the highest honor in teaching bestowed by the College of Science. The 2021 Schultz Leonard Teaching Award is bestowed upon Jim Paris, teaching professor in the Department of Chemistry and Biochemistry. In his 10 years at Notre Dame, Professor Paris has regularly taught the introductory organic chemistry course sequence, viewed as some of the most challenging classes students take. His course evaluations are consistently outstanding across all categories, and students routinely praise him for his dedication to their learning. 
Beyond the courses he teaches, Professor Paris is interested in developing more effective teaching methods for large lecture classes and improving organic chemistry pedagogy, and is co-author of a popular organic chemistry textbook. Please join me in congratulating Professor Paris on this distinguished award. Next, the College of Science Research Award, which was established in 2018, recognizes an outstanding investigator who has made substantial recent contributions to his or her field. I'm proud to bestow the 2021 College of Science Research Award upon Alex Perkins, Associate Professor of Biological Sciences. Professor Perkins, who couldn't join us today, is a leader in infectious disease modeling, kind of important these days, the goal of his research is to obtain a predictive understanding of where and when insect-borne diseases occur and what inter impact interventions will have and how the distribution and responses to interventions will change as the underlying drivers shift with time. His novel modeling techniques have gained widespread attention for their predictions of the spread of the Zika virus and yellow fever. So please join me in congratulating in absentia Professor Perkins for this distinguished award. We also have two faculty members with us today that have been recognized as being awarded the 2021 Dockweiler Award for Excellence in Undergraduate Advising. Our two award winners are Professor Dominic Challoner of Biological Sciences and Assistant Dean Laura Flynn. They're actually both marshals today for today's ceremony, and so if they're in, in earshot here, could they please stand and be recognized? There's one way back there, way back there. Now it is my distinct honor to introduce Madeline Owen, the 2021 valedictorian. A neuroscience and behavior major, Madeline is a Glynn Family Honor Scholar and received Notre Dame's prestigious Stamps Scholarship. She carries a 4.0 grade point average and was an early inductee into Phi Beta Kappa Honor Society. Madeline plans to attend Northwestern University Feinberg School of Medicine after graduation. Please join me in congratulating Madeline on this incredibly distinguished honor. The 2021 Dean's Award winner and the 2021 Salutatorian is Alexis Walchman. <laughs> Alexis has maintained a perfect 4.0 GPA while pursuing biological sciences major with a focus in evolution and genomics and a second major in Chinese. She plans to study in Taiwan as a Fulbright scholar and then pursue a doctoral degree in genetics. Please join me in congratulating Alexis on these two very distinguished honors. <laughs> Li Hao Yan is the recipient of the 2021 Dean's Research Award. He has performed cutting edge research in several different physics disciplines and has made important contributions that will be detailed in upcoming papers. Li Hao plans to continue his studies in the doctoral degree program at Yale University in the field of condensed matter physics. Please join me in congratulating Li Hao on this distinguished award. Now, as you can see, all three of these honorees have had extensive research experience. In the College of Science, we pride ourselves on providing as many opportunities for our undergraduates and allowing them to do independent research since we feel this is the only way to, for you to understand how to do science. So will all those who participated in research while here at Notre Dame please stand and be recognized. That's what we want to see, actually, pretty much everybody. Excellent. Okay, so now Father Jim Foster, Associate Dean and Director of the Center for Health Sciences Advising, will announce his department's degree recipients. Thank you, Dean Hildreth. The degree recipients from the science pre-professional major are Adam Joseph Achikar.
Rachel Lynn Bartnett. Christopher Joseph Burney. Mary Catherine Camacho. Kyle William Casey. Lucia Cho. Alyssa Louise Danielli. Tyler Mitchell Dan. Vanessa Shantae Davis. Stephanie Kaylin Deschner. Ryoki Michael Dejamo. Lena Tuiyi Do. Derek Sheehan Ekenyaki. Cindy Ugochi Emenalo. Matthew Lee Feldman. Kira Marie Gallagher. Jeffrey Thomas Gerardo. Alexander Ryan Goskowitz. Michelle Renee Grady. Samuel Ellis Grew. Morgan Gail Heilman. Danielle Mackenzie Houston. Brian Edward Kelly. Devin Joseph Kennedy. David Kim. Elise Marie Kisla. Catherine Grace Kostolansky. Mackenzie Lauren Kramer. Madison Jean Keel. Daniel Frank Liggio. Natalie Ann Loro. Austin Huang Li. Megan Catherine Leiden. Tommy Joe Mansell. Samantha Alyssa Martinez. Emma Caroline Mazurek. Mary Colleen McCanns. Carolina Moreno Alvarado. Aishwarya Natarajan. Michael Alexander Newcomb. Andrew Pichai Nagov. Alejandra Hasmin Osorio. Mary Grace Martin Phelan. 
Colin McRedmond Ragsdale. Kate Elizabeth Ram. Keegan Christopher Riggs. Nicholas John Riggy. Justin Christian Holt Roy. Rachel Paxson Sabnani. Daniel Biagio Shaw. Jill Maria Stakowski. Kelly Marie Straub. Lauren Elizabeth Sullivan. Alex George Thomas. Ursulina Phyllis Tomzak. Koi Tan Tran. Jillian Olivia Valley. Marissa Rose Vandermissen. Olivia Ann Van Verlo. Eric Matthew Verhe. And Noel Vincent. Next, Professor Nancy Michael, Director of Undergraduate Studies and the Neuroscience and Behavior major, will announce the first half of her major's degree recipients. Thank you, Father Foster. The degree recipients from the Neuroscience and Behavior major are Mariana Ferre Lebron, Willen De Campos De Faria, Giselle Gomez, Lauren Nicole English, Gwyneth Marie. Gasper. Cassandra Joan Frankie. Mary Elizabeth Friedland. Morgan Claire Foley. Leah May Gudex. Andrew John. Meinhard O'Neill Alexander. James Stanley Balloon II. Anna Christine Benedict. Jake Joseph Berg. Christopher Reese Bine. William Arthur Blotcher III. Catherine Sheila Bockholt. Muxit Basharat Bush. Leah Grace Capuano. Elizabeth Catherine Caradonna. Megan Riley Coggins. Madeline Grace Cole. Isabel Alida Correa. Aiden Patricia Crowley. Maria Chujin Diambros. Phoebe Freitag. Samantha Garcia. 
Adeline Marie Di Cristofano. Ryan T. Gensler. Laura Lee Fabian. Ellen Louise Gorman. Megan Elizabeth Green. Irving Delgado Arellanos. Rebecca Lynn Hammond. Leah Elizabeth Harmon. Sarah Elizabeth Hatfield. Chloe Nicole Hem. Aaron Colleen Herbert. Isabel Marie Hornung. Samuel James Hunt. Edith Obasade James. Olivia Ruta Jesbutis. So Min Joe. Morgan Catherine Johnson. Yura June. Gabriella Kim. Kelly Ann Colick. Catherine Marie Kubik. Next, Professor Steve Cortelli, Associate Dean, will announce the second half of the degree recipients from the Neuroscience and Behavior major. Thank you, Professor Michael. Christian Elijah Lontero. John Tanner Liu. Monique Latran. Chelsea Omawumi Logo. Michaela Murphy Marone. Kendall Lee Marston. Joseph Van Orman Mastroni. Megan Sophie McCabe. Luis Medina Bengston. Monica Elaine Mezikar. Chase William Miller. Maria Anita Miller. Emily Marie Mall. Jeff Verite Musima Jr. Deirdre Victoria Nelson. Alex Frederick Nisbet. Oksana Geneva Olachuk. Madeline Marie Owen. Andrew Jean-Claude Pick. Mariah Ann Parsons. James William Passman. Sarah Noel Peterson. Alessandro M. Prada. Tracy Preco. Haley Elizabeth Rigu. Donald Anthony Rea. Joshua Paul 
Rillinger. Quinn Charles Scallon. Olivia Marie Josephine Shoyerman. Cheyenne Ray Schuster. Carolyn Grace Seymour. Emily Grace Sienko. Nike Beatty So. Jamie Celeste Spencer. Catherine Ann Sport. Autumn Elise Stevens. John Andrew Swift. Rihanna Maria Tarabokia. Tanner Wayne Tarkelson. Mario Syriac Chaya Chuakado. Keely Elizabeth Thornton. Noel Whitney Townsend. Emily Matsuko Unabasami. Garrett Edward Verforth. Emilia Chuzui Wang. Oh Andrew James Watkins. Kelly Ann White. Yuki Yoshioka. Next, Sister Kathleen Cannon, Associate Dean for Collegiate Sequence Majors, International Studies, and Diversity, will announce the first half of the degree recipients from the Collegiate Science Majors. Thank you, Professor Percelli. The degree recipients from the Collegiate Sequence Majors are Abigail Rose Batkoff, John Paul Becker, Noah Benjamin Best, Madeline Emily Renee Beinlich, Molly Elizabeth Brombach, Austin Lewis Briggs. Preston Michael Carey. Bridget Bevan Carmody. Andre Christopher Catown. Nicole Bauer Chang. Evan Alexander Cook. Marielle Bouvier Corbett. Emily Ann Cotrill. John F. Craddock III. Michael Daniel Dubosky. Dean Allen Delp, Jr. Aaron Elizabeth D. Donato. Oh. Where's you gave me some Samantha. Yeah. Yeah. Samantha Ishani Ekanayaki. Cameron Danusha Ekanayaki. Eilish Marie Eschweiler. John Patrick Esposito, Jr. Abigail Catherine Fida. Katrina Marie Fliotsos. 
Miguel Maximilio Gerard Hoffman. Joseph Daniel Brosnan Gorman. Antonio Franco. Robert Schaefer Garrett III. Caroline Hart Greeley. Joan Catherine Griffin. Brenna Grace Halligan. Jack Andrew Harness. Sydney Lauren Hayes. Amanda Rose Jurassic. Victor Abdulio Cara. John Paul Klein. Chandler Quinn Coatsios. Katharina Zoller Lawrence. Mara Rose Lee. Anna Carol Lowney. Daniel Mat Denai Matara. Megan Kathleen Matuska. Jack Thomas McConnell. Thomas Quinn McCoy. Caleb Stefanos Mahari. Kevin Mitchell Michael. Jasmine Verena Moawad. Gabrielle Lee Wynn. Jacob Aiden O'Hara. Elizabeth Ann Olmanson. Liara Sofia Ortez Ocasio. Next, Dan Gazelter, Associate Dean, will announce the second half of the degree recipients in the Collegiate Sequence majors. Melissa Pavlov. Grace Alexandra Petrosini. Mairead Renner Pfaff. Teresa Marie Reynosa Ibarra. Sophia Marguerite Rodawig. Kellen Joseph Round. Maria Elizabeth Salerno. Luis Gabriel Santa Maria Delis. Michael Francis Shannon. Tatiana Noel Silva. Nicholas Everett Spitzer. Allison Rose Sterasinic. Anne Catherine Treacy. Christopher Paul Vallis. Caroline Jane Wagner. John Benjamin Walter. Ashlyn Shunting Wang Wang. Andrew Patrick White. Sean Thomas Wilkinson. Paige Nicole Zibelli. Peter Robert Zinsley. 
Hope Vera Baldwin. Elizabeth Catherine Brown. Alexis Marie Driscoll. Emmett John Flynn. Claire Catherine King. Samantha Alyssa Mosca. Jonathan Miles Plas. Marina Margarita Suarez. Graduates, parents, families and friends, faculty, welcome. As I mentioned earlier, this is the first and maybe the last ever College of Science commencement, um, but now I have the privilege as dean of offering some brief remarks. So first, I wanna offer my sincere congratulations to all of you graduates. You made it. This has been a very, very hard 14 months for all of us. As you know, last year's graduating class still has not yet had a proper commencement. I mean, even two months ago, we didn't have any idea if the events of this weekend would be possible. Yet here we are, the vast majority of you are completely vaccinated. I think this is a modern miracle of medical science, but it was made possible by decades of previous research, by incredibly driven visionaries, and all of this has put us where we are today. We now have the tools to squelch this pandemic. Now, I don't think we can declare victory, of course, because the overwhelming majority of people on the planet do not yet have access to vaccines. Many things could change in the next few months as new, more elusive, and contagious variants develop and begin to spread. Still, there's a note of optimism. We have the science to fight this virus. What's missing, of course, is the hard things, the manufacturing, the distribution infrastructure to reach the rest of the world. So I think we should take this as a lesson that basic science, without which we really can't even start, needs help to finish. Scientists are key, but so are people who understand science logistics, science in society, science in policy. Since I'm the dean of science and a scientist myself, I would argue that science has to be at the core. But we need help from those who understand how science can relate to the rest of the world. Many of you here today have studied and plan to work at this interface between science and everything else. And I wish you in particular great success. Science needs advocates wherever they can be found. I hope that all of you as graduates of the College of Science can be passionate about science and communicate that passion to the world. We always talk about science for the greater good. At this time in this place, Communicating the results and the process of science may be the good we need. I'd like to follow with a brief discourse on the scientific method. I can see the eyes rolling out there. <laughs> so this discussion is based on the commencement speech at my own graduation more than 30 years ago. And yeah, maybe longer ago than that. But anyway, so let me take a quick poll. How many of you remember the contents of the valedictory address at your high school commencement four years ago? Okay, that's what I thought. So now this particular speech, so this was like more than 30 years ago, this must have made an impression on me because I still remember what it was said. And so the subject of this address was butterflies. So now Matt, where's Madeline? So now I suppose you've already written your valedictory address for tomorrow, so I probably should have communicated this to you before, but if you want people to remember what you say at commencement, butterflies, talk about butterflies. Okay. 
So now I've given this a local twist because as an undergraduate, my son worked in a laboratory here in the Department of Biological Sciences studying an endangered local butterfly called the Carner Blue. How many of you have ever heard of the Carner Blue? Pretty much nobody. Okay, anyway. So first let me pause though. So parents, four years ago, I was in your shoes, proudly looking on as my own son received his degree. It's a great feeling, isn't it? So graduates, let's stand up and give your families and all of those who've supported you a round of applause. So before I tell the story, I have to say, most of the things I do as dean, I don't get to smile very much. This is the most smiling I've done in, in months. So thank you for all of that. This is, this is great. OK, so here's the story. It's very brief. Four friends were walking from, let's say, Breen Phillips over to Jordan Hall, and they collectively spot a corner blue butterfly. The first year student says, hey, they have blue butterflies here. The sophomore being more specific, says, well, we at least know that there are blue butterflies on the library quad. The junior, not to be outdone, says, more precisely, there is at least one blue butterfly on library quad. The senior, wise beyond her years, corrects all of them. All we really know is that one side of one butterfly is blue. That's the whole story. But why this, why this stuck with me, though, because what it illustrates is that process that we all go through, both in scientific learning and scientific discovery, of understanding what we do and what we do not know. Science learning and science research is based on this process of elimination, winnowing your facts and assumptions to understand what's missing from the limits of your, of your knowledge. Then you pursue that missing piece of information or understanding until you discover the answer. Or, even better, you discover more things you don't know. And then the cycle of research and discovery continues. So it's this, this idea, this sort of uh, constantly narrowing what you do and what you don't know that drives all of science forward. And so that, that uh, conversational analogy stuck with me all these years. And so hopefully you'll, think of, you'll remember butterflies, if nothing else, from this talk. So our hope for you, as you finish your time at Notre Dame, is twofold. First, we hope we've pushed you to find the limits of your knowledge and to move forward into the unknown where learning and discovery lie. A science major is hard. You did not pick the easy road to go through Notre Dame. But we hope, as you've grappled with difficult concepts, foreign ideas, that the process of learning has made you wiser. We hope the experience you've gained has taught you about yourself, about how you learn and about how you can do science. Second, we hope that we've instilled in you that curiosity, that drive to figure out what you don't know and to chase that until you understand. As a scientist, it's easy for me to say that because this is my life, this is what scientists do. But most of you are not gonna be career scientists running around in robes doing whatever. You have a more important mission though. Think of how society would be different if every person had this scientist's outlook of looking at a problem or an injustice and then figuring out what we don't know so that that problem could be solved. Our hope is that you can take that thirst for knowledge and problem solving and apply it as widely as possible. Use the analytical tools we've given you to engage your neighbors, your networks, whoever you can to fix things. We've seen so many of exa examples of an idea, brilliant or not, coupled with hard work that turns into the right idea that enables progress. So whether the topic is scientific or not, I think this is science for the greater good at its strongest. So as you leave us to do great things, I urge you to bring your inner scientist to bear on problems great and small. I think this is the way to achieve progress. So graduates of the class of 2021, I wish you congratulations. I wish you the best of luck. God bless. Godspeed. Thank you.
So let's all applaud our newest alumni. Congratulations. Before the benediction, I would like to offer some words of thanks to all the people who helped make this ceremony possible. So first, I would like to thank the band for their wonderful performance under the direction of Sarah Eamon, led by Sam Sanchez. I would like to applaud the event Notre Dame staff, the studio Notre Dame staff, the ushers, and everyone else who helped us organize this event. I'd like to thank the staff from the registrar's office with, with particular thanks to Linda Martellaro and Laura Spaulding for their tireless efforts to help organize this College of Science first ever diploma ceremony and the rest of the university commencement exercises this weekend. These people do a tremendous amount of work and they know how everything works. So please give them a round of applause. And finally, I'd like to thank as well the faculty and the staff of the College of Science the College of Science Dean's Office staff has been working for weeks to put all this stuff together and they've done a, a fantastic job. So uh, all the volunteers who were marshals for helping with the ceremony, we really couldn't have done this without you. So thanks to all of you for putting this together. And now I would like to invi invite Alex Thomas, one of your classmates, to come forward to offer the benediction. And finally, so that we have an orderly exit at the end, after the platform party recessional, I ask that you wait for the marshals to dismiss you by row and exit through the tunnel. As you walk out, keep walking like as far as you can go to the reflecting pond so that we don't have a giant traffic jam. And so you can meet your families out, out there afterwards. So please rise now and remain standing after the benediction. And so we conclude as we began with prayer. Almighty God, we gather here today as a community that is ever so grateful to you for our time here at the University of Notre Dame. And we ask for your continued grace as we depart from Notre Dame. We thank you for making this day possible, for all of us to come together with our families, friends, and all those who have supported us throughout our journey at Notre Dame. We thank you for keeping us safe during the pandemic, protecting us with your grace, and for giving us the opportunity to gather once again in person to commemorate and celebrate our time here together. We thank our professors, faculty, and staff for their mentorship, flexibility, and encouragement as we navigated our time here. We thank our parents, our siblings, family members, and friends by our sides with us today for always believing in us, the class of 2021. Our beloved family members and friends have rejoiced alongside us in times of triumph, have provided us with strength when we have faced challenges, and stood by us during our four years at Notre Dame. We thank our fellow graduates for their friendship, their hard work, and most of all, for their adaptability, perseverance, and resilience. 
Heavenly Father and Notre Dame, our mother, as we each move on to the next chapters of our lives, we ask for your continued guidance and blessings. Bless us with wisdom to use the knowledge and skills we have learned at Notre Dame and to be a force for good in the communities we are about to enter and serve. Bless us with hope, courage, and strength to persevere when we are faced with challenges and adversity. Bless us with the gift of faith to trust in you, holy God. May you continue to guide us with your spirit as we embark onto the next chapter of our lives. We ask that you bless our class of 2021, today and forever. We ask all of this through the intercession of Our Lady, Notre Dame, Our Mother. Amen. Glory. 